It's moved our stream across by a lane. So we've got the Wesley Plazier, Patrick Van den Bogarda game, the final throws of the game. Wesley's just made it 3-3, so Patrick won the bull, so he's got the darts in this seventh and final leg. Wesley's not un unfamiliar with 3-3s. Three he won his last 1-2-8 game 4-3, and he's won his last 64 game 4-3. So it's still a tall ass, but he's back in the game, and he's put pressure on this 1-2-5 from Patrick. That looks like a 25, or is it a 7? It could be a 7, actually, but bearing in mind the second dot's going in 18, so 25 scored. And there we go. That's what we were talking about, about this pressure. Plazier has the 145. Oh, my word. What a way to win this would be. Treble 15, not to be. 75 leaves 70, treble 10 or treble 18, treble 10 leaves tops. What a dart and from absolutely nowhere. Plazier is now your favourite to qualify for the last 16. 95, treble 19 or the bull. Treble 7 leaves 74. Gone for double 17 and tops. Interesting way to go, he's missed the board so therefore 74 with two in his hand. Should be treble 14 or treble 18 here. Now he's ruining the fact that perhaps he should have gone treble 14 with his second dart. But Plazier yet again for another 4-3 victory. I think he just likes the stage time and he's done it. He's done it. He's won the game by 4-3. He's, <laughs> well, eternally grateful, I guess, for, for doing that. And uh, you've got to feel for Patrick there. He was well in charge of that last, last leg until the big... 130 from Wesley put the pressure on and uh, that was the difference. Wesley Plazier is into the last 16 of the Dutch Open.